Hi, welcome back to another video of me being bored. I hope you're ready, I hope you stay tuned, and I hope you enjoy. Right now, I'm just writing my to-do list, trying to figure out what I should do today. That's pretty much what like the point of a to-do list is, I feel like. Figure out what you should do, right? I do need to wash my car. There's a whole lot of bird poop on it, and I need to drop off a package. When it comes to washing my car though, I swear I wash my car and two days later it rains. It's like God is just not on my side sometimes. But before I do that, I clearly need to get ready. I'm clearly, I mean is it that clear? Is it? Is it that clear? I'm still in my pajamas. I haven't showered. I'm still drinking my morning coffee. What was I even talking about? I think I've drank too much coffee and I'm just bouncing off the walls right now, but <laughs> I need a shower. I'm probably gonna do my makeup to make me feel a little bit happy. Like I guess maybe looking, feeling somewhat cute also makes me feel somewhat good about myself. Who would have thunk? Maybe I'll throw on an outfit I just thrifted for my last video. If you didn't check out my last video, one, you suck. Two, check it out. <laughs> I'm just really all over the place. I apologize, you guys. I'm gonna do that, so let's get to that. Before I get into the shower, for some reason, I wanna show you the products I use. So this is a black-owned company. I definitely highly, highly recommend you guys support them, you try out these products, because it's this big of a bottle, and I think it's like eight doll hairs, maybe? Like doll hairs, eight doll hairs, are you joking me? But this is their shampoo and this is their conditioner. It is a virgin coconut oil, everyday coconut, purely coconut, that is the scent of this one. And I also have their body wash, let me grab it real quick. Okay, so this is their body wash, it's everyday shea, it's vanilla mint, that is the scent for the body wash. But I wanna go over a couple things that are on the back of their bottle. It says, Alafia is a social enterprise on a mission to create a more sustainable and equitable future. Our women-led cooperatives in West Africa produce heritage, nutrient-rich African ingredients rooted in tradition. When you choose our handcrafted skin and hair care, you join us in empowering women and families in Togo, West Africa. Together, we're cultivating beauty, equality, and empowerment through the following projects. Maternal care, 5,115 births funded. School supplies, 37,426 recipients. Bicycles for education, 9,592 distributed school construction, 14 schools built, eyeglasses, 27,463 distributed, reforestation, 81,073 trees planted, and the bottle itself is recyclable. When you buy their products, most of that money, I don't know how much, what the percentage is, it goes back to supporting all of those things I just told you. So it's like, that makes me feel so warm and cozy inside knowing that I'm supporting a black owned company, which is also supporting other things that are in need. So definitely check them out. I think I get my products from Target. The one thing I must say is that while I've been searching and shopping in stores for black owned products, I am coming to the realization that they are at the bottom of these shelves. Like I get it. I, I love that they're in store. I love that some stores are giving more shelf space to more black owned companies. But girl, why are you putting them at the bottom? Like, why do I have to search through all these white companies and get to the bottom and then find Alafia? Tell me that. Tell me that. So, support them and let's get them to the top of the shelves at the stores, right? So, I'm going to take a shower because I I'm just blabbing on. I'm done showering. I've put my facial moisturizer on, so I'm going to start doing my makeup. When it comes to makeup, like... I feel like at the age of 22, maybe I should have it down. Like, I see my other friends and I'm like, bitch, how do you do that? You look fabulous. You're glowing. And then I use some of the same makeup they use and I'm like, I think I look better with no makeup. I have not mastered the art of makeup, so I apologize. You know, if maybe this face you see right now may be better than the face you see later on. Good luck to me. Okay, I'm gonna ask myself up real quick because girl, did I snap? Did I snap? Because I feel like I snapped. So if you don't think I snapped, personally, I'm hurt. I feel victimized, but it's okay because it's kind of just what I think about myself. If I feel beautiful, then I guess I'm beautiful. Before I go downstairs, I wanna show you that outfit. I'm just wearing this gray shirt. I probably got it from the thrift store, honestly. And then I'm wearing the Universal Threads pants that I just thrifted. Make sure you check out that video. I had a lot of fun filming and editing it. Toaster oven is on. Waffles are ready. Ya girl is making chocolate milk. I use oat milk pretty much with everything. I haven't tried this one. Well, that's a lie. It's my first time trying it. I've tried it already. I think I can recycle this, so I like that. The only thing 
The only complaint I have, girl. I hate when things need to be refrigerated. Well, I mean, no, that's like, okay. But like when you open it, you need to put it in the refrigerator and you need to use it within seven days. I'm like what the, a time frame on when I need to finish my oat milk? No, I, I, this is too much stress and pressure on me. I literally just read about this like last night, but Aunt Jemima, she's getting a rebrand. It's gonna be something else. I heard after they were in talks about changing the brand name that the family was like, no, 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 we don't want that. We want you guys to keep it. So I'm confused. I'm up in the air, you know, struggling to figure out what's going on. But one thing I do know, they will still be offering their syrup in this bottle until June. But then after June, it will no longer be Aunt Jemima. Therefore, after I finish this syrup bottle, I'm literally keeping this. Catch me in 10 years on eBay because you can find her right there. If you hear noise, I apologize, I'm washing my dishes. I can't just pause the dishes for you guys, I'm sorry. I need to get a car wash, like I said, it's on my to-do list, and I do have this free car wash little coupon, but the thing is, my anxiety is so bad to the point where I'm like, I don't even think that I can handle going to a car wash that I am not used to by myself. So it's like, do I spend $6 to be comfortable, not go outside my bubble, or do I just go to one that's six minutes it's from me, it's closer, it's free, but be a little bit uncomfortable. Where the f is my colorful soap? I just paid $10 for this car wash. I have paid less because I got the homie hookup before in the past couple years here. Now I got no homies here, but I used to get colorful soap for six bucks. I paid 10 bucks and I got no colorful soap. Hey, hey, hey. I'm done washing the car. We're squeaky clean now. I have my pina colada air freshener and we're gonna head over to the post office now. Where am I? Hello? I'm back home now. If you hear squeaky noise, it's my dog in the background with their toy. I'm not gonna be a Debbie Downer tell them to stop so I can film. That is just selfish. I'm hungry though, I'm gonna make some food. It's that chicken pasta I bought in the last video. If you haven't seen it, you suck, go watch it. I'm going to Target really quickly just to get some dog food. I'm probably gonna go into Best, I almost said Best Buy, Bed Bath & Beyond. Is that where I'm going? All of them just sound the same right now. Bath & Body Works. I'm gonna be going into Bath & Body Works because mom, you got me a gift card and what do you think is gonna happen when you give me a gift card? I'm gonna use the gift card. There's a specific coffee candle that I am looking for, so I'm gonna see if they have it. If they don't, they don't, but that'll be sad. I got my candle. Oh, this is so cute. It has a coffee maker on here, some grounds on here. Oh, this is so cute. It's called whipped coffee. I guess they had two different coffee candles. It smells so good. Oh my God, I'm so happy with this. You might be wondering why I still have my mask on. It's because I gotta go to Target now and honestly try to put two masks on with makeup on and hoops on. It's not, it's not it. So I'm just gonna keep it on until I get to Target because I'm in the same plaza as where Target is. I'm done with Target. There's no point in doing any good lighting right now, honestly, but I'm going to McDonald's for like the first time in what, three years? 
Daniel saw that they have Pokemon Happy Meals and they have like some cards in there. So one location I called, they're sold out. The other one I called, they only have 10 left. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna get four. Hopefully. Do you guys still have the Pokemon Happy Meals? Yeah, we do. Thank you. When I say I've secured the bag, I mean I've secured one, two, three, four, four bags. Five, if you want to count that. I'm back at my house. I've eaten both of my McDonald's Happy Meals. I've gotten my cards. Every pack, just kidding, surprise, I'm not going to tell you. I filmed a mukbang opening all of them, eating my McDonald's food, which I have not eaten in over like two and a half years. I filmed a mukbang, so it's up on my channel. Make sure you check it out. I'll link it up above. But yeah, that's it. I'm going to start to wind down, which means I'm going to start to drink a beer, which means I'm going to take a shower, take my makeup off, get comfy and then drink a beer. So with that being said, that's a wrap. I hope you guys enjoyed my day with me today. That was very odd. I don't think I worded that correctly. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe, and ring the bell so you're notified every time I upload a new video. I do have a second channel. Make sure you check it out. Subscribe to it as well. All my socials are linked down below along with petitions and donation sites that way you can continue your support for the Black Lives Matter movement. But that's a wrap, guys. Peace out. I've seemed to prolong.